Good morning, STM. On this particular morning, we would like to honor a former graduate of STM, Emily Razzo, who has recently passed away. In the next minute or so, I'd like for our school community to take a moment to stop where you are, whether that's in the halls, walking up the stairs, or making your way to class, so that we can learn a little bit about Emily and the legacy she leaves behind. Emily Razzo attended Corpus Christi Elementary School and in 2007 became part of the STM family where she developed so many long-lasting friendships. Emily was a loving human being who always found the good in people. Emily was a very well-rounded person who excelled academically, athletically, and professionally. She was on the honor roll and at the top of the class in every grade while at STM. She was successful in cross-country, cross running, and figure skating. While in grade nine, she played a significant role on the 2008 senior girls soccer team who captured both the indoor and outdoor city championships. That same season, she scored a goal, a goal at the OFSA tournament. Emily was also named team MVP several times in her senior years. She was known as the kid with the blue shoes. After graduating from STM in 2011, Emily went on to study mathematics and computer science at McGill University in Montreal. Her degree and love for soccer were the perfect match to land her a dream job with EA Sports, specifically as the senior product manager of the FIFA soccer video games. Devastatingly, Emily was diagnosed last July with extremely rare form of non-Hodgkin's lymphoma. Throughout her courageous battle, Emily continued to maintain her amazing sense of humor, optimism, selflessness, and her beautiful contagious smile. Emily has left her family and friends incredibly proud for being the sweetest person one could ever meet and for what she accomplished in such a short time. At the same time, she has left them with a massive void that will be so difficult to fill. May the Lord Jesus Christ grant her eternal peace and may perpetual light shine upon her. Now let us make a sign of our faith. In the name of the Father, Amen. and of the Son, and, the Son, and, and of the, the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. The peace prayer from St. Francis of Assisi. Lord, make me an instrument of your peace. Where there is hatred, let me sow love. Where there is injury, pardon. Where there is doubt, faith. Where there is despair, hope. Where there is darkness, light. Where there is sadness, joy. O Divine Master, grant that I may not so much seek to be consoled <coughs> as to console, to be understood as to understand, to be loved as to love. For it is in giving that we receive, it is in pardoning that we are pardoned, and it is in dying that we are born to eternal life. St. Francis of Assisi, pray, pray for, for us. St. Thomas More, pray, pray for, us. for us. In the name of the Father, Father and, the and the Son, and of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit, amen. Have a great day, STM. Good morning, St. Thomas More. Mr. Danny speaking to you for a quick moment. Uh, this is a message that I've been asked to relay on behalf of our grad committee. This message goes out to our graduates uh, this year coming up this Thursday, May 30th. All graduates are expected to attend the grad mass at Regina Monday Parish on um, Thursday morning. Please arrive by 8.45 a.m. Parents and guardians are both welcome uh, to attend the mass. Immediately following the graduation mass, graduates, you are to make your way down to the Hamilton Convention Center uh, by Carmen's at, summer, at 1 Summer Lane by 10.30 for grad brunch. The brunch is for graduates only. Um, following the brunch, you will be lined up in a numerical order according to your last name, and you will, be, you will proceed to First Ontario Concert Hall for the graduation rehearsal. At rehearsal, you will receive your entry ticket for the evening ceremony. The tickets that you picked up last week are for your guests. Graduates, arrive no later than 6 p.m. on the night of graduation to pick up your gown package. You are responsible for your own transportation to all graduation activities. Please be aware that parking can be difficult for the ceremony uh, that evening. Trust us when we say parking is difficult. It is not a great location uh, for people trying to get many cars in the area. Please leave ample time to be there for 6 p.m. The dress code for the day is business, business casual. Remember, school continues after graduation. You still have classes and exams to complete. If you do not finish the school year, universities and colleges offers can be rescinded. It is vital for you to understand that although we're going to a convocation and graduation ceremony, you will actually graduate after you get all your credits, and that will be at the end of June. 
Uh, I'm excited for the evening for all our graduates. We look forward to seeing you there with your families. Uh, God bless and have a great day. Good morning, STM. My name is Kiara. And my name is Nico. And, and here are your announcements, announcements today. today. The yearbook track photo will take place after school on the track today. All track and field athletes are to meet on the track for training for South Regionals and will practice after the photo. Attention all Relay for Life participants! If you would like to keep your luminary bag to bring home, or if you lost your water bottle or an item at the event, please see Mrs. Sarango in room 151 during period 2, or after school today, or tomorrow. KFC members are reminded of our meeting today after school in room 151. There will be no meeting tomorrow. Attention all diversity members! There will be a meeting today after school in the library. Thanks, SDM. STM, those are all of your announcements. The time is now 8.20. And remember, it's a great day to be a knight.